So, to make hot cocoa, we need two cups of water. One cup for you, one cup for me. And this just happens to have two cups of water in it. So right now, this is the only thing I have that has measuring lines on it. Which sucks. Because... Quite frankly, I don't want to have to carry that around all the time. Oh, fuel. Don't fuel, Daddy. This is the Benchmade 530S. Everyday carry. Size of a biomass stove is that you got to keep feeding it constantly, right? See all those bubbles? That's the sand. It's about ready to boil. What do we need boiled water for? So we can make our hot cocoa. Huh. Taco goes even got marshmallows in it. Since this is plain water instead of stream water, we probably really don't need to actually get it boiling because by that point it's pretty hot. And I don't know if I'm going to drink it that hot. What do you think? You like your water that hot? Just gonna call it right there. It's pretty much boiling as it is. Not close enough. Damn, by eye, look at that. And you're gonna enjoy the nice view. Uh, pleasant colors. We like fall colors. This is the end of October and we still, I mean we got some colors going on here but there's still a lot of green in there. Yeah, but did you know that in the winter pine trees still have the pines? Three leaves like poison ivy, huh? I just say three leaves and poison ivy. Is that three poison ivy? No, that's four leaves. It looks like five leaves. Yeah, it's an extra ivy. Look at that. That's a recently fallen tree. Are you going to walk right behind me? What? So what, are you going to walk right behind me? Look at those rocks up there. We can climb there. Yeah, you're going to go climb them? No, you don't have to take me. Oh, are you going to bring me to me? Look at that. Look at that rock right there. Look at that. That one. Look at 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 that rock. Oh. What? What well, they got over here? Is it like a crime scene or something? Ooh, that's what? far down. Uh oh. Yeah, there might be a cave under here. Yeah, you want to go down and find out? Yeah. 
Oh, let's go. Following you. Take it slow. I think that. How about you go this way? Your stairs right there. If you go this way, then you don't have to worry about uh, that yellow or orange rope that says stay out. Come on. Be careful. Yeah, be careful. No, no cave. Shucks. I am, are you? Yeah. Cool. Let's go down and see the lake. What do you say? Let's go that way. Let's go through the rock bed. Look at that hill. Well, we'll keep out of that. We'll go this way though. Daddy. Look how steep that is. Do you think we could climb that? I don't know, kiddo. We probably could, but uh. Yeah. It'd be easier if it was all rock. Mm-hmm. That's a lake. I think this used to be underwater here. So the lake must be kind of low. Here, I thought that was all back up to normal. Normally that thing should probably be completely underwater. Ooh, look at that rock. Make sure you don't fall in the lake. Oh, I won't, if you don't. Hey, look. That's mud. Yeah. Oh, shoot. I wouldn't step on that either, huh? Look at that. Look how steep that is. How cool. Get that. Got mud all over your feet now, huh? Daddy, you wanna keep walking? Strange rock. Yeah. You wanna keep walking? Look. <laughs> Wait, there's some more rocks. Yeah, but we don't need to throw them all in. Yeah, but Watch this. <laughs> I wonder if there are any campsites over here. What do you think? You think you'd be able to find your way back? What? Think you'd be able to find your way back? Yeah. That's wet. Yeah. Creek. Yeah, there's a creek you can jump across. You yank it? Yeah. Oh. You made it too. Yes, I did. Let's find that giant rock right there. That's to be one little hole. You think you can climb that rock? Let's see. Do you. Well, how about you film? Keep it straight up and down. Don't put your hand around. it. There you go. Keep it straight up. There you go. Straight. There. See if I can climb that. Think you can do that? Yeah. Do? Come back down. Be careful. Oh yeah, get rid of those gloves. That's gonna hurt you. You can do it. Make sure you use your toes. Feel the rubber on the bottom of your shoes? Yeah. Can you grip with your hands? What? Can you grip with your hands? See the cracks over there? Get your fingers in there. There you go. Make sure you keep your toes up, down. Keep your toes down. Don't use your, uh, there you go. Your toes and your fingertips, but that's how you climb rocks. Like a spider. Good job, look at you. Now you know why you need to keep that tread on the bottom of your shoes, don't you? What tread? The tread. You yes. keep dragging your feet in the classroom, you, you wear all that tread off and then you can't climb rocks. What? Ah, here she goes. Let's go find some more, huh? Yeah, maybe. Alright. 
Let's do one more. Okay. into the ground. Why? So that'll make it dull. It cuts through uh, wood pretty easy, but it doesn't like rock. It doesn't like dirt either. Get it harder. 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 There you go. Keep doing that. Uh, one's softer now. Softer as you get closer to the ground. It's softer. There you go. So I can do that now. Okay. So what is all that? Hey. Are those shavings? Yeah. Yeah? Is that also called tinder? What this will do is it'll help us get the thing lit, all right? We start with all different sizes. Teeny tiny, small, medium, larger, huge, all right? Do we want to just pick up any old leaves off the ground to start our fire? Hmm? No, why? Because? Because they're all wet, full of moisture. They don't burn very well. Is all these nice dry tinder. Okay, we're basically doing. I'm hoping you say you don't have to do this all day. First, what we want to do is we want to shred this thing. See how it starts off all puffy? See how I'm shredding it into these little, all these fibers and whatnot? Makes more like a bird's nest now, doesn't it? See it? Getting all nice and soft like. Now, start. You gotta put that down in it. There you go. You really gotta flick it. Make sure you get the edge. There you go. Keep trying that. Just like that. Ooh, almost. How about you point this down a little bit more? Like that, yeah. Yep, nope. Point it down, there you go. Now do it. Nope, you wanna use the edge. That edge, yeah, right there. Sharp edge. There you go. Woo, look at that, you started a fire. Yeah, but forest fire. What? Forest fire. No, it'd be a forest fire if it was over there, right here, perfectly safe. Can I blow it? No, watch it, let me see that. Oh, you can see it melt. Mm-hmm, it's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah, but why won't it work? Oh yeah, this is stone. Yeah, stone doesn't burn, does it? Yeah, see, oh, and then stone does not burn. Yeah. But fire spreads. It does but it's got to start with fuel. And since there's no fuel here, uh-oh, I'm going to add some fuel. No, didn't get it done, did it? This is our kind of dinner time. Really, Daddy? Let's eat it. What about the never wreck? Dad, what about that orange never rat? The orange what? Never rat. What the heck is orange never rat? What are you talking about? Well, why aren't you using that orange cloth? You mean this time? Yeah, cloth. What is that called? Cat cloth. Come here. Oh. Now, I'm going to start a fire. Let's see it. There. Before you do it, let's get some of this stuff because we're gonna need First light. it. Got it. Daddy, mm -hmm. I have to do the Why don't you do it in that? Put it into the actual cup. Like 
that's still wrong. There you go. Put it on there only if if we want to barbecue something or cook food or something. How about those mushrooms? No, we'll use the sticks over there for those. See what I'm doing is I'm starting with all the small stuff, aren't I? Yeah, but did you bring those sticks? I did. These are the ones I've been processing all afternoon. What? These are the ones I've been processing on. You didn't see oh, what is this, this stick that you make? You forgot the sticks. Oh, no, they're in the back seat. You're talking about the sticks for uh, s'mores? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're in the uh, back seat. Alright, it's pretty much gotten going. And you started that, buddy. Good job. So, uh, car camping has certain advantages over backpacking. Sucker boiling down there. That's the beans, buddy. Oh, how cool! Look. As a boy, she used to come with me all the time. Not your mom and dad? The trick is working! <laughs> <laughs> Not so long. No, you need to just put wheels all around it. <laughs> you know what? This time, I'm not making a tank. Fashion of steel, is it? Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. The old fashioned is actually stupid. Old fashioned is stupid, huh? Nothing done in the old days was, was right, huh? They just didn't freaking figure it out until recently, did they? 
Time to uh, make some coffee. Eat hot Make coffee. some breakfast. Why am I having coffee? Huh? You said just coffee. You didn't know you were saying Oh, and hot cocoa. I'm sorry. Daddy? Yes, sir. I think that whole thing is not actually made of metal. What whole thing? No, it's not. See the two plastic handles on it? No. The metal metal. The bottom. Do you like? The flat bottom by this plastic? No, the bottom's not plastic. Just the handles. Okay, it's ready. Wow, that's hot. We're not actually having it boiled, Daddy. That's right, we don't want to actually boil it, do we? Because that would be too hot. Alright, uh oh. Yeah. Oh, sit in front of the fire, enjoying a cup of coffee. Oh yeah, that's good. That is good. Believe it or not, instant coffee can taste good. Yeah, instant hot cocoa. Yeah, we'll get that. Time to start breakfast. Certain advantages to car camp. <clears throat> you have to bring super fire. No, nah, we uh, we get to bring charcoal and our own volcano two stove or grill over there, and we can have a good old time cooking it as opposed to sitting there doing it over the fire for hours. We can bring heavy things like cast iron skillets. You never bring that back, I can hold you. What? What? I said you'd never bring that cast iron um, skillet backpack, would you? That sucker weighs as much as your entire backpack did last time. You think it's hard work lugging around a sleeping bag and a, uh, some clothes and uh, what else did you have in there? Bottle of water and try lugging around the cast iron pot. Tell you what, that Nest Cafe stuff is pretty good. Look, Nest Cafe. Nest Cafe, three and one. Nest. It certainly makes instant coffee taste a whole lot better. Let me put it that way. So these uh, chairs were a 
present for my parents for my birthday recently. Yesterday. And yes, they are not backpacking chairs, but they are uh, pretty nice uh, car camping chairs. Although I will say that they don't fold down very much, so they are a little bit harder to transport than some of those that fold down into the little tube. But uh, they are certainly comfortable, and it looks like they come equipped to, to handle just about anything. <laughs> I like these. This is really nice. Nice place to put your food, nice place to put your coffee. Daddy, first of all, 